outside. I want to look at what the temperature is going to be like tomorrow, maybe as you're heading out. So 6 p.m., it's still going to be about 110 degrees. If you had, you know, plans to take, you know, grandma and she's 90 degree, uh, she's 90 years old, I, I wouldn't take my grandpa, grandma out in 110 degree heat. So maybe you think about how you're going to go a little bit later or something like that or keep people cool in the car until things kind of cool down because that might be excessive for some people. You got to watch each other, make sure people aren't getting dizzy, overheated, stuff like that. 106 right now in Phoenix, 105 at Luke, 103 in Glendale, 104 in Anthem. We're hanging out in the 80s in Flagstaff, 90s in Payson and Prescott, 112 at Lake Havasu City, and we still have hours of heating to go. Excessive heat warnings for a good portion of southern Arizona. Clear skies overhead. We're not looking for any rain. I <laughs> definitely are Gilbert sensors off 85 degrees. No, not really in Gilbert. It's uh, much hotter than that. We're aiming for 114 to 115 dry conditions and a high pollution advisory. Not like you were going to go jogging this afternoon when it's 115, but not the best day to be working outside, uh, working out outside because of the heat and uh, the high pollution. So high pressure, it's not where we want for thunderstorms. I'd like to have this high pressure center right over the four corners, but it's a little to the southwest. So we have that um, moisture kind of rotating around the high. There's some action over here and then down by Texas and New Mexico, um, uh, Mexico. We're not going to see any storms. We could see a few in the far eastern reaches of the state. That's kind of on the east side of that high pressure ridge. So most of us staying dry for today and through the 4th of July holiday. We're keeping it pretty toasty everywhere in the state. 89 today in Flagstaff, 88 tomorrow, 86 Wednesday, 101 in Sedona, 100 Tuesday down to 97 on Wednesday. Grand Canyon hanging out in the 90s all week. That's at the top of the canyon. At the bottom of the canyon, it's more like Phoenix with those highs around 113, 115. Prescott nearing 104 today, mid 90s Tuesday, 92 Wednesday, 107 for Camp Verde today, 105 for the 4th of July. Pine Top Lakeside, usually a great retreat from the heat. Well, 94 degrees on Tuesday. It is going to be toasty there. Uh, no rain in the next seven days. It looks like we're going to stay dry in Phoenix. So 115 today, 114 for Tuesday, 113 on Wednesday. That's the coolest day this week. That's it. 114 Thursday, 115 Friday, 114 on Saturday and Sunday. When we have this much heat for this long, it also does kind of take a toll on the body day after day. So you really need to watch yourself with a forecast like that. And those overnight lows, well, they're not that low. We start out in the 80s. So please, please be careful. Young kids and older folks are most susceptible to heat-related illness. So those are the ones we really got to watch.